I believe that omega-3 fatty acids, particularly DHA, is the number one brain nutrient. I'm Julian Bales, I'm a neurosurgeon, I'm uh, the chairman of the Department of Neurosurgery at North Shore University Health System and clinical professor of neurosurgery at the University of Chicago Pritzker School of Medicine. There's never been a particular medication or any other substance that will prevent brain injury. As a senior medical advisor to Brain Armor, we are looking at exploring further understanding both with laboratory research and clinical research in human subjects. The closest we've come, in my opinion, is omega-3 fatty acids, and particularly the DHA, which is the major structural fatty acid of the brain. I believe the World Health Organization has said that in the next few years, obesity and brain degeneration are going to be two of the most common maladies or diseases that, that we face. There is credible research that shows that it is possible to create and develop new brain cells, so-called neurogenesis, generating the genesis, the birth of new cells. DHA is a vital precursor to those new cells and very important in that process. We've used high-dose omega-3s with multiple people who've had major brain injuries, coma-producing brain injuries. So the natural extension then was to utilize the omega-3 fatty acids, EPA and DHA, which is in brain armor, and which again you don't get in your normal diet to prevent or treat uh, so-called mild traumatic brain injury. For those injuries, there is no drug or pharmaceutical that can be used. So it seems to help. It seems to be something good that could be beneficial both in prophylactic and in treatment. Realize many people take better care of their cars than they do their own body. So it's a lifelong commitment and objectives that I think everyone should follow.